I have the pleasure to present to you Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. I have a dream. Congratulations, MLK. You did it. You survived the first week of school. It wasn't a full week, but I think we can all admit that it was a very, very long week. I mean, I was really tired on Friday. Were you really tired on Friday? Yes, I was exhausted. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, for those of you who do not know me, my name is Mrs. Ferriano, and I am your school media specialist or librarian, and I am joined today by... Mr. Cayola. I am a seventh grade world history teacher and humanities teacher, and I taught some of you in sixth grade last year. Happy to be back. Yay! And we're also here... What's this thing? This is the Library Chicken. Now many of you are familiar with the Library Chicken who went by the name KFC. <laughs> this year I'm imagining this chicken is gonna get a new name so I want you to stay tuned for that but we love the Library Chicken. Isn't he cute? He's really adorable, yeah. He's so, he's, a lot of character in that face. Yes, yeah, he says a lot with his eyes. That's what's really important. A lot of you have received forms in your homerooms or in your other classes uh, those forms are very important. We would like to remind you to please bring them back soon. In a timely manner. That means next week. Thank you. In other exciting news, the library is opening today for 7th and 8th grade lunch. 6th graders, you'll be having your orientation this week, and then the library will be open to you, but I'd really like to make sure you remember all of the, you learn all the procedures. Now, 7th and 8th graders, we're rolling just like we did last year. You must come with a pass. And Miss Castle will be distributing those passes at the beginning of every lunch period. So welcome back to the new and improved Media Center. Woo! Do you like to run? Do you like to run fast? Well, if you do, there are cross-country tryouts coming up this next week. This week. This week. September 10th September is this 10th. week, Tuesday. So if you'd like to run, get your forms in. Um, there is also softball tryouts. So if you'd like to hit stuff far and maybe catch it, softball is a sport for you. If you like to run a lot, softball is also a sport for you. Um, in order to be eligible to play these sports, you need to be academically eligible in the last quarter four. Um, it is open to all seventh and graders for tryouts. Um, all forms and packets need to be turned in and signed by your teachers. Um, you need to have had a physical exam from a doctor in the last two years. I hope from a doctor. I hope from a doctor. Yeah. Not from your parents, from a doctor. Um, and you need to have, again, all signatures from all seven of your subject teachers. If you're interested and you're not sure where to get the forms, of course, the main office, but you can also see Miss Newman, Coach Tahalas, and Mr. Sevilla, and he's down in the sixth grade wing for those of you who feel like you have lost them. Also, coming up this week on Thursday is... Back to school night! Woo! Woo! Back to school night. That means you and your parents are welcome to come back to school on Thursday evening so your parents can see your teachers, meet them, and get a sense of how awesome it is here at MLK. So please remind them that back to school night will be Thursday, September 12th. That's all our favorite night. Book Wars! Book, 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 book Wars! Book, 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 book Wars! For this year's first morning announcements, I once again am Mrs. Ferriano, Mr. Cayola, and I, we want to remind you to always exercise those MLK core values: respect, responsibility, integrity, and have a great day. Thanks.